I heard Grayson challenge me to a basketball game and wanted to fulfill his dream of playing the superintendent. First off, I mean, he's, he's, a, big, he's a big name for sure, but that doesn't, that doesn't matter on the courts. He doesn't want to play me, all right, because I'm, I'm what we call uh, the best. <laughs> but uh, in all seriousness, I am the best. He's young, he's quick, uh, he's got a great shot, but, you know, bigger than him. My game plan is to show him uh, who the real basketball player is, wipe the floor with him a little bit, uh, and, you know, just have fun doing it, but also, this is serious to me. I played in college. It was a small college, but I was an All-American, so I had guys talking trash to me all the time. I'm used to it. He played college basketball, but that doesn't affect me at all. You see, he played back in the day, but can he, can he still hoop? I don't know about that. He's too old to, to be playing basketball, especially with someone like me. I haven't played basketball in probably, I don't know, two years, which might make it more difficult for him when, when I actually beat him. There's no doubt in my mind that I'm gonna win, and he, he can try all he wants, he can practice all he wants, and I'm honestly not even sweating. Uh, you know, Grayson is, he's a, I, I've, I've heard some of the things he's said, and he's a, he's a theater student, he's a Friendswood kid, he's well-rounded, he's in a lot of different things. So, I mean, he can act well, but I, I can see in his eyes, he's concerned. Mr. Rohr, I'm not worried at all. I could honestly beat you with my left hand, but I mean, bring me what you got. Grayson, Mustang Pride Unleashed, class of 1986, be ready.